Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you my face routine. I'm going to start off by any face milk by 4th Ray Beauty and this works as my moisturizer. I absolutely love these and I just got this new avocado one in the mail. So I was testing it out and I am in love. Here I'm showing you all the primers that I like but in this video I'm using the All Nighter by Urban Decay. And I'm just going to put it like in my T-zone. Um, I usually like to focus any moisturizer on the perimeter of my face and the primer on my T-zone because I do have larger pores. Um, I'm not really looking to fill them in, but I just focus any primer that I'm using on my T-zone. Okay, so for foundation, these are my favorites at the moment. First, I'm showing you any drugstore foundations that I love. Um, I do have combination skin, so keep that in mind when I'm showing you all these foundations. And here are some high-end foundations that I love. Um, in today's video, I'm going to use the Maybelline Superstay Foundations. I have two shades because I bought my shade too dark and I bought my mom's too light. So now they're both mine, so I just mix them. I add, I'm dotting the darker shade all over my face and then I'm going in with the lighter shade. Now I'm going to take this foundation brush by Japanesque. It's super dense and it literally feels like you're beating your face, but this is why I like it. I don't like to use sponges anymore. I feel like it soaks up a lot of the product. Um, so yeah, I'm just going in with this brush and I'm blending it all out. And don't forget to get the neck. Don't forget to get your double chin. You know, blend it all out. Make sure you can't tell that you're wearing foundation. So I was planning on showing y'all all the concealers that I like, but it's way too many. So I'm just going to show you the two that I'm using. This is the Milani Conceal and Perfect. And I'm just dotting that under my eye. And then I'm taking the Koki Be Bright and I'm putting it like on the, what is it, the outer corner of the eye to kind of give you a little like facelift. This concealer is lighter than the Milani one. So it just brightens up a bit more. I'm going in with this sponge by Araceli Beauty. I believe it's called the Bella sponge. I do not wet my sponges anymore. This is a dry sponge. I just, like I said, think that it soaks up too much product and I like using them dry anyways. So yeah, just blending it out. I didn't show it, but here blur powder by juno and co and i'm putting it all over my face this was the first time that i used it and i actually really really like it if i wasn't using this i'd be just setting my whole face with the maybelline powder or the anastasia loose powder in translucent okay i am so sorry for the faces that i am making in these clips but I'm just dusting it all off with a big brush. I do not let it bake. Now we're gonna bronze. This is a Hula bronzer by Benefit, my favorite. Um, I think I mentioned it before, but I do not contour, I just bronze. And then I like to do my temples, and then I'm going in with some blush. This is by ColourPop. And I put it on the apples of my cheeks and bring it up a little bit. And then I just put a little bit on my nose, not too much. I think blush makes me look a little bit weird, but I like to bring color back into my face. Okay, this highlighter is amazing. I love the Super Shock Shadows by ColourPop. And I believe this one is in Manifest That. I think that's what it's called, but I love it. Okay, hear me out. So you put it on, right? Beautiful. It looks like... Like it looks amazing and then when you set the face it just gives you like i don't know how to explain it it just looks so good and i love it okay so i don't usually set my face that's something that i don't like to do but if i look too powdery then i will go in and set it and also this highlighter just looks a lot better when it is set if it makes any sense just look at it it looks so good then i'm drying it off um yeah i don't have a little fan i should get one but i don't have one okay 
and that is it um these are the products that i use almost every day i hope y'all enjoyed if you have any questions let me know make sure you subscribe comment like this video and i will talk to y'all in my next video i hope you have an amazing rest of your day bye